The trial of two brothers accused of capital murder in the deaths of a child, her mother, and another woman has been delayed. The reason the district attorney's motion to recuse himself from that case was actually granted this morning. Paul Venema explains why the DA asked to be removed from that case and what happens next. This fire three years ago killed 10 year old Sammy Ochoa, her mother, Rebecca Gonzalez, and Gonzalez roommate, Pam Wenske. Investigators believe the three were stabbed to death and the fire intentionally set to cover up evidence of allegations of sexual abuse. The child's father, 32 year old Conrad Ochoa, and his 40 year old brother, Baron, are charged with capital murder in the deaths. Today, their trial was delayed after the district attorney asked to be recused. From a purely legal standpoint, the office may have been able to remain on the cases. We did not, not want to inject any possible issues for appeal. Following a brief hearing, the motion for recusal was granted and the search for a prosecutor pro tem begun. We're going to get this done. I'll let you know as soon as I find a, a prosecutor who has the time and the ability to take on a case. This is one of over 300 cases in which the DA has recused his office because of prior involvement as defense attorneys. Out of those are about 72 felony offenses, um, with the majority of them being misdemeanors. The exception, the Ochoa brothers. It's a capital murder case in which the state is seeking the death penalty. All of this will take time as the special prosecutor reviews the case and develops a trial strategy. Best guess for a trial date, late summer. Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.